In the eighth question, we have integral of cosec x. Okay. So integral of cosec x, what is that equal to? So you remember integral of cosec x, indefinite integral of cosec x is important. And what is that? Log mod cosec x minus cot x is there. Plus constant of integration. This is the formula. Right? Integral of sec x is log mod sec x plus tan x. And this is cosec x minus cot x. Therefore, i, which is equal to integral from pi by 6 to pi by 4 of cosec x dx will become equal to, substitute the limits in this, log mod cosec x minus cot x from pi by 6 to pi by 4. By the way, there's another version of this. I'm not discussing that version because NCRD people haven't used that version, given that kind of a version, but there's another version in terms of tan, right? This can be simplified in terms of something called tan, right? What is this equal to? This is log of cosec pi by 4. Now, let me write the value of cosec pi by 4 directly, which is root 2 minus cosec cot pi by 4. What is cot pi by 4? Cot pi by 4 is 1. This is what you have. This is the first term minus the second term log of modulus cosec pi by 6 is important cosec pi by 6 will be 2 minus cot pi by 6 cot pi by 6 will be root 3 this is what you get modulus and there's a bracket right so this becomes log this minus this log this minus log this will be log this upon this root 2 minus 1 upon 2 minus root 3 this or this Either this or this is your final answer for this question, right? Root 2 minus 1 is a positive, so modulus can be removed, replaced with the normal bracket. 2 minus root 3 is also positive, modulus can be replaced with the normal bracket. This or this can be my final answer. Anyone can be given, right? That's the final answer for this eighth question, as you can see over here.